a big agency can afford a $5,000 per customer acquisition. They don't really care. You cannot. You, you, you peak around $1,000 to $1,500 and you, you can't bid with them. You'll run out of money. Everything works until it doesn't. You have to be able to pivot. We originally did SEO. Uh, and I, I knew SEO as my background uh, 15 years ago. I used, to, I used to do websites, SEO, and PPC, and then I specialized in PPC after. But I knew SEO, and I did a lot of SEO for our website, and it, it did well in the beginning. Um, and it was making the, those niche pages. I'd make Google ads for plumbers or something and do heavy optimization on it, and it actually ranked years ago made so many updates uh I, I don't have time to keep up with it so i need to hire an seo uh because or go a different direction uh and then we did uh just straight google ads for our own business and a very long time ago ppc management company ppc ad agency we bid on that phrase match hit it really hard maybe a hundred dollars per lead and you know you'd close one out of four so the numbers were crazy and they were good. They were really good. And then it was $30 CPC, $80 CPC, $200 CPC. I think the big agencies just turned on their, their impression share bidding or, or whatever. Uh, and, and they have an infinite budget. So, you know, we were getting $500 leads, $1,500 leads. And again, I'd, I'd advise anybody to talk to someone a lot more successful for you than you and other business owners. And a friend of mine said, look, a big agency can afford a $5,000 per customer acquisition. They don't really care. You cannot. You, you, you peak around $1,000 to $1,500 and you, you can't bid with them. You can't have $5,000 per new client. You'll run out of money. Um, yeah. So that strategy stopped working, but it did work for about two years. We just bid on PPC ad agency. And it, it just printed money. Uh, and then... Um, you know, a bunch of other things that didn't work, but at, at the moment, um, YouTube's been really good. And th this was an Alex Ramosi thing, actually, uh, if it originally came from him or not. Some of it brings in new leads. The other things help you close. So now I've taken the course and put it all over Falcon. You know, we founded the Online Advertising Academy, you know, biggest, one of the biggest YouTube channels in the industry. Look at all these experts. Where It's sort of like speaking at a conference. It, you can help close like look I, I published the book i have a youtube i'm i have all these awards i've done all these things that's why you should hire me it's a closer in addition to sometimes you get new clients from it so youtube has helped with that it's kind of like who are you compared to every other agency it's, well, it is a massive youtube channel and and someone else can't quickly make a massive youtube channel and compete head to head it's a lot of work so that's that's what's working now um, focusing on a niche is, is working well. And that, that was a, that's another thing that's, that's in forge. That's that. Um, and I've seen these ads. I just haven't done one. It's kind of like, are you a, do you want a plumbing company? We can get you more plumbing appointments now. Hey, plumbers call us and the landing pages for plumbers. And then we help plumbers just narrowing it down. Um, that, that works extremely well. And I, I thought that was kind of guru nonsense. We haven't run that since uh probably last fall and it's like okay I'll, I'll i'll do a pilot and i'll run it and that that highly targeted thing works surprisingly well going all in on edge i mean technically hvac and plumber and every other thing are the same just different keywords but it's like well i, I could grab a bunch more plumbers that makes an ad that says hey plumbers we help plumbers and it's like that actually works very well yeah and to uh but to really accelerate it, you need to layer on top a couple of things like your positioning, a better offer than a free audit. Yeah. Um, and also, the this is inside forward, the, the proactive mindset. So putting together something that is a proactive value add or strategy. So most people are reactive. Um, and, of course, if everyone went down the niche route, there would be no niches. But no one's, not everyone's going to do that. But uh, what... I discuss inside four, just going that extra mile. So you fill in all the all the blanks for that business. So you mentioned plumbers. So what can you do to make their life easier? So it's not just Google Ads anymore. It's not just the landing page. You've got to fill in all the gaps 
up to the point where they make the sale. And if that, that means tracking all the phone call recording, it means listening to phone calls as well and vetting yeah. what they're doing uh, and vetting the quality of the leads that come from your work. Uh, the follow-ups, like even getting involved in doing email follow-ups or SMS follow-ups um, and beyond. So it, I, I think we used to be, I used to call myself a PPC specialist agency 10 years ago because we did PPC. Then we started doing niches and called ourselves specialist. I think actually to be really specialist, you've got to hone in on that offer and say, we work with this industry and we do all these things that orbit that industry. Google Ads is at the heart of it, of driving the traffic and leads. But we do these things that mean what we do is so valuable to your business you're not going to leave us because you'll go to another agency that just does Google ads. Oh no, they do landing pages. It's like, yeah, is that it? Well, try and compete with us. So I think that's the next level of value add and positioning. And then it starts at the niche, but you're adding all these layers on top of it. So it definitely works. It definitely works. It's a bit more effort, but um, it sounds like you're going down that route and you're digesting some of the stuff inside Forge, which is brilliant. Yeah. It does work. 